The small town of Granajeno has been a hot spot for undocumented crossers for several years. As some say the activity has slowed down some. We found there is still a divide among residents about life in the border community. One community, 313 people. Two different perspectives about life in this town located just steps from the Mexican border. I feel more at ease knowing that there's uh, uh, government agents out there protecting the borders, which is okay with me. I don't think a border wall is the correct uh, way to solve the problem if there is a problem. Aurora Garcia tells us this is the place where she spent her childhood. After 36 years living elsewhere, she's back home. Instead of the sprawling acres of land she remembers running through as a young girl, now there is a retention levy in her backyard, and the countryside sounds are now often replaced by this. I felt oppressed because of the presence, the constant presence of the Border Patrol, DPS, ICE, everybody was around here. Alcario Ansaldua lives about half a mile down from Garcia. He hasn't left the town he's called home all of his life. He says that these sights and sounds are now just a way of life here. And sometimes when I'm asleep, you can hear all the, the rotors spinning. And yeah, it vibrates the house and all that, but, you know, it's all right. You know, they'll, be, they'll fly away. Both agree that the activity of immigrants that cross the border illegally and cross through their lands has died down. Ansaldua says his guard is still up with the possibility of thousands of Central Americans headed for the border. I am worried about them rushing the borders and, uh, and like, um, like, a thousand people to a couple of agents. That's what I'm worried about. Garcia is doubtful that scenario will play out. Immigrants, for the most part, are really good people that are just seeking a better life. Some of them are asylum seekers. Many of them just see the United States still as a land of opportunity. Despite their differing experiences in a town that continues under heavy vigilance by Border Patrol agents, both agree on one thing. This is a good place with good people that we are not in any way living in a chaotic environment. Granjeno is a cool community. Everybody knows each other. Everybody knows who, it, who everybody else is. Um, we're pretty united. This is a place both will continue to call home. Daisy Martinez, Channel 5 News at 6, Granjeno.